75th anniversary of the company, this is a very, very uh, big turning point. Uh, I think uh, the company is renewing itself. For me particularly, what I feel so lucky to have been part of the period of time that 14 years in the company, um, well, when you compare from 70, <laughs> 75, it's not that much, but still, I got to experience, to me, what American Ballet Theatre was in my dreams. Growing up in Cuba, uh, of course, American Ballet Theatre was only a dream. America was only a dream. For me, to be able to be sitting here talking and celebrating about the 75th anniversary of American Ballet Theatre, 25 years ago, it would have sounded like a crazy thing. I got so inspired by, you know, all the people uh, that came and performing here, Makarova, Baryshnikov, uh, Gelsi, um, Kevin, all, I mean, all these amazing people that uh, perform uh, with American Ballet Theatre, the amazing history it had. I remember growing up with watching Don Q from uh, Baryshnikov and uh, Cynthia Harvey, and I saw what an amazing thing would be to be performing there, and then, 15 years later, I'm wearing her costume <laughs> and performing in that amazing stage. I think it will be a highlight of my life, probably. I mean, when I came into the company, um, ABT had the most amazing group of male dancers. It was like uh, so strong. I've never seen something like that in any company at any time. So I felt extremely lucky to get to dance with all these amazing people and to get to perform with them on the stage and to get to grow with them. Dancing with Julio Boca in his retirement performance of Giselle is probably one of these moments that will always will stay with you. Uh, mostly because Julio, actually dancing with Julio was one of my dreams also when I was a very small kid. I remember him coming to Cuba to the festivals, performing and being, I mean, being completely in love with this person, like this amazing dancer. Um, and thinking, you know, like a little girl thinking, dreaming to dance with this person and then getting there. I mean, the generosity, so the generosity and the level of mastery that uh, performer had on the stage. Uh, was something legendary, and uh, to just be able to experience that, um, I mean, it's something that you cannot put a price on that.